All right guys, so I just walked up to a hole that I fished about a week ago. Here it is. Not only is it completely covered in ice, it's also got like six inches of snow on it. So safe to say this stretch of river is out of the picture until the next thaw. It's gonna be at least two weeks, potentially not even till spring. So that's pretty depressing. This might be my favorite stretch of river for winter fishing. So time to go somewhere else. What's up guys, Frey here. You probably haven't seen a video from me for a while. That's because winter has hit us really, really hard here in Michigan. As you can see, there's just snow everywhere. There's over a foot of snow on the ground. We had a winter storm yesterday. But anyways, I haven't been able to steelhead fish because steelhead rivers that I fish are all frozen bank to bank, just ice. So I can't steelhead fish really. There is actually a spot near where I am right now where there is some open water that I might try to get some steelhead later in the day. So there's still a chance for steelhead, but as you can probably assume, I'm gonna be out on the ice today. Gonna to be ice fishing, which is not my style, but got a bunch of baits, a bunch of different stuff to try out, and I'll be fishing for whatever bites today. Hopefully catch some nice fish out on the ice to show you guys. Okay. Double minnow rig, straight to the bottom. 30 foot of water. I'm hooked up. I'm hooked up. There's just no way. The day it's been, I can't believe I'm gonna find fish. Walleye, let's go. Let's go. Found them. Let's freaking go. It's not a big one, but check out this walleye. I'm stoked. I'm beyond stoked. I've been fishing all day. The sun's about to go down. I just got a walleye. This one feels better. I'm not gonna lie, they don't fight much, but this one feels heavier. I've been out here since the morning. I took a little break midday. It feels so good to finally get on some fish. All right, guys, I've been working really hard out in the cold to try and get some fishing content for you guys. I only caught two fish in this video, but I will be out on the ice later this week trying to figure those fish out and the weather's turning for the better. So should be more good stuff to come. But for now, I'm gonna add some content to this video by showing you guys some really good footage I got of my pet pike eating from the leftover guppies I had before and also from some minnows I put in. Got some really good footage and these things are just, they're so awesome to watch them eat. They're super cool looking fish. I love them. Got some really good footage to show you guys. So hope you enjoy it. So we got the tank here looking real good as you can see 
think one of the pike just went for the minnows there. I've got four of the smallest minnows from the ice fishing earlier today, and they're not doing very well in this hot water. I've actually got the rest of the minnows, the leftovers down there. Hopefully save some money and use next time. But anyways, gonna feed these four minnows to the two pike, which are down there, lurking patiently. These are a little bit bigger than the guppies that these pike are used to, but I don't think they'll have a problem eating them. They might though. That's a pretty big minnow. Oh, tail first. That's one way to do it, buddy. Well, he's out of commission for a while. I don't know if he'll be able to swallow that tail first. There it goes. Is he gonna hit it again? Hit it head first. There you go. Smart guy. 